It's been a month since we started homeschool. It wasn't a decision that we decided on a whim. It took me a year to finally take that leap to go forward. I finally gathered enough courage to start this year. Before we started with our transition, I wanted to ask for advice from people around me. There were more doubts than encouragement. That made me start questioning my decision. I had sleepless nights thinking if this was going to be the right decision for my kids. One day I woke up thinking, instead of focusing on the negative, I should focus on the positive. I asked myself first why I wanted to homeschool in the first place. I started joining homeschool groups to get the right advice and support from homeschooling families. Who knows homeschooling better than families who are already doing it, right? I asked questions and guidance in this new journey that we were about to make. I am thankful to the people who took their time answering my questions. Without their advices and encouragement, I would probably not know where to even begin. The first few days when we started to homeschool was hard. I knew it wasn't going to be easy. There were tears and whining constantly, especially for my five-year-old. He would refuse to do any of his workbooks. He would run around the house and try to hide. But books isn't the only way for him to learn. I so I chose activities and manipulative that would catch his interest. It's been working out well so far. I had to carefully choose the right books for my third grader. I chose books that would make him love learning. I want to fill his mind with wonder and curiosity, not just answer the books because he had to, but he wants to. Bubble and the 